starting off with the Kristen Smart case, um, the FBI has told uh, the Smart family that there has been some stuff in the case that is going to start moving it forward, and they made an official statement, so I'm just going to read that. <clears throat> Um, over the past few days, our family has been overwhelmed with inquiries about the investigation. We sincerely appreciate the amazing support we've received and want to be clear that this is an ongoing investigation that is complex, fluid, and continuing. The San Luis, Obispo's County, San Luis Obispo County Sheriff's Office is leading the investigation and they are not putting any timetable on the completion of it. We support the Sheriff's Department efforts and commitment. It is vitally important that you take the necessary time required. That, that, that they take the necessary time required. To clarify an important point about timing, there is no current timeline for any announcement. When the Sheriff's Department completes the investigation, they will notify all of us when there's news to announce. Thank you for understanding and our shared interest in this ongoing investigation. Gnarly. So basically, they don't... They can't put out what yeah. they told them. Uh -huh. That's, it's just between the FBI agent and them, you know? I mean... I got a good feeling things are going to be solved by the end of 2021. Oh, no, or for sure. I, I'm thinking sooner than the end of... Yeah. Chris Chris blew this case open and got the fire started in everyone's ass. It's know? insane because even our own little podcast was lo virally local, like... Yeah, we just had... Or a, lo locally viral. We, I said that backwards. Yeah, we had our homies looking. We had our par parents watching family friends it's, it was cool it was cool to see everyone pop out and really watch the, sh the podcast it was cool meeting chris too cool dude sweet sweet to have his musical background put like on our podcast too because it really hasn't been discussed very much when we're when we're talking about it yeah when he's talking about on other podcasts and shit like that yeah i feel that and um it's cool that a lot of people care now because like even in the years after, like, it just started to get really quiet for the whole investigation. And I think all the noise around it and people just watching, like, everything and being really invested. And, ha and that, that Facebook group, too, the Find Kristen, Kristen Smart Facebook group, yeah. has gained, like, 3,000 people in the last three days or something crazy. So That's pretty gnarly. I think it's starting to I get... I joined it yesterday, I think actually, it's starting to get day. bigger, like, on, a, on, like, a true crime, like, people wanting... Not that it's entertainment, but you know what I mean. Like, there's a lot of people who are, like, who are into that type of stuff who are paying attention to who aren't from here, if that makes sense. Yeah, there's a lot a lot of people that I'm not familiar with on there. It's kind of interesting. And everyone has their opinion on there. It's kind of cool. Well, I'm really glad that we're going to figure out what happened. and that's Yeah, hopefully much. we see, see resolved by the end of 2020. That'd be cool as fuck, you know? Yeah, we will definitely see resolved. Um... <laughs>